the rain. We don't get the free rain, so we have to work every day, but we don't get too much rain. Thankfully, I'm collecting that water right behind it. Here it is today. I put another fence on for chickens. Uh, keep them out while I'm gone because I'm not the scarecrow on there. Yes, Bob? I was going to put some black ABS on the side cut in half, so I have basically a tray, and I was going to leave that away to some of the trees in the orchard. Ideally, we were thinking about making taro patches to grow the local island starch uh, in a little marshy land on the outside, but I need the airflow for pollinators now because the roof is, it goes, it goes to about two feet off the ground. So we were going to do cover crop on the outside that we could you know, chop and drop um, or get like buckwheat and, and some grains, but we decided to keep it there in an air-free zone. On your property, do you have any advantage that's big enough? Yeah. 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 I was going to use bamboo to keep the chicken. The chicken thing was like a, a six-month struggle. I was going to make little rainbow bridges, just little twiggly bamboos so they wouldn't fly in. But uh, harvesting the bamboo is hard work. They're like 150 feet long. You cut one, and you're trying to pull it out, and it doesn't want to come out. And it's, it's a really tough situation. And uh, since we're serious about the garden, we want to use it every day.